Yeah. Cool. I have now had this channel for just over a year. I first made this channel on July 18th of 2016. Uh, this past year has gone a lot better than I expected on YouTube. I didn't really expect it to go really anywhere because I know a lot of big YouTubers and stuff, it takes four or five years just to even get like some kind of fan base going. And I'm not very skilled at doing the vlogging or anything like that. I'm trying to get better and I don't really have the best camera equipment either. I mean, the camera's great, but I don't like have the mounts and like all that kind of stuff. So I didn't really expect it to go this well. And I've also haven't made very many videos. I mean, I kind of only make a video when something really happens. Like I'm kind of, I'm not very good at like coming up with my own video ideas. I'm trying to get better at that, but I just want to go over some of the analytics for this last year's page. Um, this last year I have gotten 20,000 views, which is pretty incredible. I never thought I was going to get 20,000 views in one year. I mean, a huge part of that is just because of that Type R video. I really would have only been at like 10,000 if I didn't hit that video. But either way, I'm really glad about the support and the feedback that I've been getting from you guys. Um, we have a total 303 likes, which is way better than I ever expected. We did get 19 dislikes, but whatever. Um, 74 comments, which is great. I really love when you guys comment on the videos. I really, I love responding back to you guys, liking them and all that kind of stuff. Love hearing your guys' feedback, so that's been great. 113 shares, even though probably at least more than half of those with myself. Still pretty good. Um, apparently I have 84 videos in playlists. That is definitely not true. I don't know. I'm not sure where that number is coming from. And then a total of 82 subscribers, which about a month or two ago I only had 50, so that's going really well. I'm really glad to see the increase in there. I mean, most of that was because of, again, that Type R video, but oh well, that's still pretty cool. Um, I have a total of 30 videos. And then I also have a list of the best videos, like, per video and stuff like that. Um, the Type R video was obviously the best one of this last year. And I think this is in terms of watch time, so how many minutes of actual watch time. Um, the Type R video is number one. My Nissan 350Z head unit install, which was this thing right here, was number two. Um, my It used to be named Basic 350Z Mods, but like I didn't really know what to name it, so I changed the title of that one to cleaning my air filter and replacing some stuff. And that one is number three, and then when I got my new wheels on is number four. So, I've been really happy with the uh, feedback I've gotten on all those videos. The Type R video has 11,000 views right now, which is just incredible. I did not expect to get that many views on a video, on that video. 68% of my viewers are from the United States, 5.5% are from Canada, and the United Kingdom is 3.6%, and Japan is 3%. So that's kind of cool to see that like people are watching my videos kind of all over the place. I have a 95% male gender for the for people that are viewing. Um, it's just really cool to go over all these stats, especially at the end of like a full year, just to see how much everything is gone. Like it show it has like all the graphs and everything. I'll show you guys, but it's just really cool to see all the stats from everything. Like it's just I don't know. It's really cool to me. Um, I can't wait to make more videos this year. Hopefully, I'll have an even better year this year. That's all I'm gonna try to do is just be better than I was last year. Um, my videos have definitely been getting kind of better. I can still do a lot better, I know, but we're getting there. And hopefully I'll have more content this year because I plan on doing more stuff to the 350Z. Like I just ordered a new air intake. I know it's just something simple. I should have done that a long time ago. But I'll do a little review on that. And then I want to get a new full exhaust. So once I have the funds, I'm going to buy that. Um, there's just a lot of little things that I'm going to do to the car. And I want to go for some performance mods next. I got the front bumper on so it looks a little bit better. So I'm going to do some performance. Hopefully the exhaust, intake. And then I might do like a plenum spacer or something like that, maybe an intake manifold. I haven't decided on that one yet. But I hope you guys stay tuned for the next upcoming videos. Thank you so much for all the support I've been getting so far. I love you guys.